Cuxhaven on Germany's North Sea coast is a center of fish meal production. Seagulls keep watch in hope of some rich pickings. These days, however, there is little being thrown away. The shrimp shells and other fish remains are sent straight to reprocessing. In the factory, what was once refuse is now viewed as a valuable raw material. With recycling, you always might have the suspicion that it's about stuff that's been rejected and is now being reprocessed. But what we do is take the byproducts of regular food and turn them into high quality products. The head and bones are left over after the salmon has been filleted. They can then be used to make oil for food production or even for direct consumption. You can eat it and it tastes good. And how does it taste? It tastes like a fillet of salmon. It might not quite have the same consistency, but it definitely tastes like salmon. The first step in the reprocessing is to shred the leftover salmon parts. The resulting pulp is then put through a machine that separates the solid and liquid components. The next step is to separate the watery phase from the oil in the fluid. What's left is a clear, odorless and salmon-colored oil, pure and rich in nutrients. It contains high levels of unsaturated fatty acids that are considered good for human health. Our oil can be used as an additive for the food industry. There's omega-3 bread, for example, or orange juice fortified with omega-3 fatty acids. You can also put it in capsules as a dietary supplement. The oil is not the only interesting product. This press squeezes all the liquid out of the fish remains. This sample of what is called stick water was sent to a Danish lab facility for assessment. The results led to the creation of a special process that isolates the valuable nutrients in the water. So the proteins and other useful substances do not go to waste. This means no more refuse. The global population is rising as we know, so we're making some small advances in terms of feeding the world. And this could be a food of the future, a powder rich in protein with anti-inflammatory properties, a byproduct of salmon pulp. There's a big demand for the powder, although for the seagulls, it means no more free lunches.